Welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. Interleague Baseball on MLB The Show. It's the San Diego Padres taking on the Baltimore Orioles. First pitch coming your way next. So almost ready to get underway and on the hill Corbin Burns what should we keep an eye on here he's a dominant pitcher but he can get a little too relaxed second and third time through the order and miss his spots that's where we see him get touched up if he maintains the same intensity that he has in the first inning and the second inning I think we'll see him hand the ball over to his closer ready to go now and here is Xander Bogarts. And a pitch. And that one fouled off. Line drive. It gets down. Base hit. So a man on base to start the inning. Showed a willingness to drive that pitch the opposite way. Didn't get jumpy, didn't try to pull the ball, let it get deep, took the barrel right to it, and then extended through the swing for the line drive base hit. Swing and a high fly ball. That one out towards left center field, way back there. High bounce takes it over the fence for an automatic double. And boy, do they catch a break. Otherwise, you're looking at runners around the bases and probably a run that scores. Now here's Jake Cronenworth. Golden opportunity right here. Ripped on a line. Makes the catch one down. Puts the tag on him, and it's a double play. He comes up firing, and there was an anticipation and kind of an excitement when the ball went in his direction that he was going to have an opportunity to throw somebody out. And that's the attitude that aggressive and good outfielders have. And a pitch. Hardliner. And no one can get there. Runner holds it third. So even with two outs, they didn't risk it. He was all over that one. That ball was drilled. 106 off the bat. And that's the kind of feedback that tells you you're right where you want to be with your swing mechanics. And now, Ha Sung Kim out there to center. Mullins in pursuit. Brings it in, and that's the third out. Padres leave a pair, and now the O's will get their first crack at it. No score. Major League Baseball is on the show. Back here with my pal Siggy, today's starting pitcher. You Darvish. What's the scouting report on him? Leading off. Well, he comes at hitters with a five pitch mix, so for him, it's always interesting to see how he utilizes those weapons. He may lean on one or two pitches depending on how things are going and how things are working, but if he can control four or even five of those offerings, look out, hitters. It's going to be a tough day. He's really going to be able to keep those guys off balance. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Oh, there's a small sigh of relief right there. I mean, just to keep that speed off the base paths, it's not just the pitcher. It's other guys that have to think about it from your infielders, have to think about that runner potentially stealing, but also be in position to make a play. As an outfielder, you're thinking about a base hit to the outfield. i got to get to it quickly to try to keep this guy from taking an extra base. So I think everyone just a little more relaxed that he didn't reach base. Went up there looking to be aggressive and got something he could handle. First pitch fastball in a great spot to do some damage and he squared it up nicely. Anthony Santander in the box now. Take strike one. Swung on, belted. Merrill on the move, racing back. Out of here. Ball game. He'll circle the bases, and the Orioles walk it off. Hitting a walk 
walk-off homer is the kind of thing you dream about growing up. You're in the backyard, you're creating the most pressure-packed scenario, and what do you do? You come through with the big swing. Well, he was living a childhood moment right there. Nice swing of the bat, nice win for the team. 2-0 your final here in this one as the Orioles win this one for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Chambi saying so long 